Hello, Internet. I thought I would do something different today and show you what I have in my sketchbook so far for this year. It's uh, been a few months in progress. I've shared some of the videos of the works in progress. I'm about like halfway through this, and it's been like three months, I'd say. So, a little slow, but here we go. So, this one you can find on my channel. I've actually recorded the process of drawing and coloring that. But some other things on the page include Grumpy Girl, Dorsteno, and Sad Girl. Then on the back, we've got this drawing of uh, Lava Lava Senshi. I do love me Neptune and Uranus. This painting, playing with colors, perspectives, an eye. I do love Sailor Jupiter. Some color practice. A shrimp. Some more doodles. These paintings. This one is actually on my channel. This one not. But it also exists. Some uh, tracking paper from when I lived in Japan. And this painting I like because I, of course, love tentacles, but I like the little person kayaking up top, so it adds that little extra something for me. I'm not really sure what this one is. <laughs> uh, I blame uh, Hellraiser. We'd watched that recently. Wicked Lady. Giving a naughty finger. One of the fiery gang from the Labyrinth movie, one of my favorites. Book it down with the fire gang. We've got a couple of sketches I did with like an orange marker. <coughs> Excuse me. We've got this lavender lady. Cozy cup of comfort. The paint is really thick. This was when I first started playing with the gouache. Jelly gouache. Gouache? I don't know. But I really like the colors in this. Or Neptune, sky scene, night scene, little angel lady with the boobs, trees, <laughs> trees, girl on a bus, pastel fade, got ripped when I took the tape off. This one, you can see the full video process on my channel. This one I didn't record, but I do like it. I was trying to do something with like a diamond. Get that gem shiny. Didn't quite turn out the way I wanted it to, but it's also kind of fun. Something different. This was inspired by the river scene that I used to see when I lived in Japan. I would walk past the... Um, wasn't, I think it was the Q Edo River. It wasn't the actual full Edo, but it was like an off tributary that ran through Urayasu. And so on my walk home from Disney, some nights I would walk along this road that had a really pretty hillside and the river. And then you could see like apartments and things on the other side. So this one actually has like a nostalgia to it. Again, more nostalgia. Hands, eyes. Actually used reference, which is kind of different. Or at least I, but then this one with no reference, and so I kind of hate how it turned out, but I still shared the video because I took the time to record it. Sailor Saturn doing her awakening. I always really enjoyed Sailor Saturn, so I wanted to paint her, and I kind of took some liberties with the style. I like it. Uh, this one is uh, inspired by Kuchisake Ona, and so the hair is hiding the second mouth. Um, also just wanted to play with red skin tones. And since I had a bunch of red on my palette still, I figured I'd use it up and paint this guy. It's something. I censored this one. <laughs> uh, playing with anatomy, doing bones and muscles and whatnot. Girls, a 
more ladies. This one, I don't know. I like her. <laughs> Some critters. So we've got a rat begging for his snackies. We've got like Balto, a beaver, <laughs> a squirrel. Snarf. So this is the uh, beginning of a series of ones that you can actually see on my channel, but I do love how it sparkles. It's not really picking up. There we go. I went over it with the gel pen at the end, and I just really like that glitter. It feels very magical girl, very Sailor Moon appropriate. <laughs> Sums up a lot. Also just playing with character ideas. And then we've got good old Mizuno Amito. Hinore. Again, there is glitter in here because she's a magical girl. She's got a sparkle. A bunch of Dr. Horrible stuff because I like Dr. Horrible. And then some anatomy. Faces. Just playing around, having some fun. A uh, mermaid version of myself playing with an octopus that I didn't finish coloring because I didn't care for it that much. Jupiter! And again, you can see she's got the sparkles. Venus. Doom, 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 doom. And again, Sparkle City. Yeah. Um, Spike, though I don't think it looks like him, so I. Ah. Got a happy girl in a sundress, zombie dude, Ohashi, Okuchi, Omeme, <laughs> Chubby Pikachu, person with their ribs coming out, hand actively drawing a dude, <laughs> and his little chonies. Ooh, squeaker face. Booty pop flex. Pow, pow, pow. <laughs> because I amuse myself while I draw. On a similar sort of tangent, we got this guy. Na na na. Hazukashi in the morning. Derpy squeaker face. Jigoku e yokuzo! And homie. Yes, that is what she said, homie. Some more uh, censoring in here. I like working with pinks and grays. Epi. Lots of epi here. Do, do, do. I do enjoy how the pinks and the grays play together. He's just my pretty boy vampire. Because everyone's got to have one, right? I like this guy. Give him a name. What should I name him? <laughs> uh, I don't remember right now, but he did have a name. Mm. Some more sketchy mix sketch. Playing with the pinks and the grays again because they're easy. Not hajimarimas. Oh no, my god. Joe desu. Yoroshiko onegaishimasu ne. Ah, Joe san. So his name is Joe. <laughs> so desu ne. Then more sketchy mix sketching. So we got some elf looking ladies, pretty boys. Purple hairs, mermaids. Another painting. I didn't film this one because I just wanted to make it. And not have to think about it too much. I mean, it's still leaving a lot to me to be desired. But I'm not going to fudge with it anymore. Oh yes, hi friend. 
I love Zoidberg. <laughs> With these, I was trying to do um, just simple one line drawings where you don't lift the pen. So that's why everyone's kind of got dreads. And um, some of these are inspired by The Office because that was on. So we've got like Angela, do, 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 um, Dwiggett, Jimmy, Jim, Jimothy, James, Squeaker, and this five rats. And yes, Zoidberg in attack mode. And lastly, this page where I just futzed around testing some of my colors, some squeakers, a hand, and some color opacity practice that I ended up spilling water on. So, <laughs> yay! But I hope you all enjoyed this little tour of my sketchbook and what I've accomplished thus far. I'll come back and do another video when I am done filling the sketchbook out. So in probably like three more months or so. <laughs> so, that is that. Hope you all had a great time enjoying my sketchbook with me, exploring it, and here's my workspace. Have a great evening, night, day, whatever it is for y'all, and I will talk to you later. Bye!